The term modularization refers to a construction method using independent, interchangeable modules, or parts of a whole, that are standalone and can easily be changed. It is not uncommon as you visit websites to see that the navigation on each page is the same. It can also be true for the header or branding area of the site as well as the footer. Let's look briefly at an example site, hamradio.com. Look closely at the header, navigation, and footer. Now, let's move to a page for a radio that's available from this online retailer. As we arrive at the page, again, look at the header, navigation, and footer. You'll notice that they are the same. Because these three areas of the site tend to be static, they are great candidates for modularization. Modularization can be accomplished in a number of ways, involving databases as well as snippet files. In this short video, the use of snippets will be shown. While there are more than one method of implementing modularization, let me demonstrate the one which I prefer. In the template or file to be used, include the structural elements for these three sections, header, nav, and footer. In each section, build the content that would be found for the site. Run the template or page to ensure that everything is working as expected. Now, one at a time, remove the content from each section and place it in a separate PHP file named appropriate to the code snippet it holds, for example, header.php, navigation.php, or footer.php. I suggest storing these snippet files in a folder at the root of the website project. With the content placed in separate files, we'll write the code that directs the server to inject the code back into the template or page prior to sending the file to the browser. Within the structure of the template, write a PHP code block. Within the code block, place a PHP require directive that uses the server's root directory, for example, require space dollar sign underscore server all uppercase square bracket single quote document underscore root again all uppercase close the single quote close the bracket immediately following the root directory append the path from the website root to the desired file for example dot single quote forward slash PHP motors forward slash snippets forward slash header dot PHP close quote semicolon in PHP the period is the concatenation operator when done save the file and run it in the browser the content that was present originally should still be present repeat this process until all modules have been injected into the template once completed any file created from the template will have the same snippets. The advantage to this approach is that when an update needs to occur, the change only needs to occur within the snippet file in order to be reflected throughout the website. 